The information communication world is growing at a very fast rate. It's all about being abreast with modern trends of doing things or simply being left behind. The African continent is making giant inroads to catch up with emerging trends and meet the ever-green demand for high-quality service providers as well as gadgets. This was the focus of the 2013 Nigerian Telecoms Awards, which saw Ghanaian entrepreneur and chairman of Agam's Holdings, Roland Agambiri, sweep the coveted African Telecom Personality of the Year 2012 award. At a media briefing during a short presentation of the award to Mr. Agambiri in Lagos, Nigeria, chairman of the organizers of the Nigerian Telecoms Awards, Otumba Biodan Ajiboye, described the man Roland as an unusual person with a passion for African empowerment. A man who says, I want to have a factory in five countries of Africa. I want to dominate Africa. I want to brand a particular product of mine, an African name, Uhuru. He didn't choose a Ghanaian name where he came from. He didn't choose a Nigerian name, a big, the biggest market. He chose a Kenyan and Swahili kind of name. The chairman of Agam's Holdings, Roland Agambiri, said the focus of his company is to become the leader in renovation on the African continent and beyond, create more jobs and ensure skills impactation. For me, it is a kind of a missionary and a messiah work to begin to change the minds of the people of Africa that we can start very small, but we can grow bigger and larger in the world. The African Telecom Personality of the Year Award 2012 is in recognition of the contribution of Roland Agambiri to the promotion of access to ICT facilities on the African continent and his efforts to create socioeconomic growth among young people through ICT. The awards, which is an eighth ninth year, recognizes the contribution of individuals and organizations towards the expansion and growth of the telecom industry in Nigeria and West Africa in particular, as well as Africa in general. Beatrice Baden, ETV Ghana News, Lagos, Nigeria.